let's go. a good two hour ride. I'm excited. The pack is actually quite a quite a sizable pack. <laughs> Instructed people I've told people that it's nothing illegal. Just don't stop our security guards. <laughs> Whatever that means. This ride is called the Road Less Traveled. <laughs> Jeez, I had a whole bunch of topics that I spoke about and some of them I weren't happy about so I had to redo and now I can't remember what I, what I had talked about and what I wanted to talk about. So, whatever. Um, oh, okay. Uh, let's talk about this topic one more time. I, I had I, this would be a redo of a topic. Uh, I don't think I'm going to post the old topic up. I mean, whatever, start over. Okay, so <clears throat> someone asked me to do uh, a video on more, more videos on relationships in that topic. Well, okay, that's a good one. And another person told me to do a video on you know, what's it like dating uh, different cultures. And another person wanted do one on communication you know different type of communication and whatever so I've got a I, I got a real good example of all three combined it was this case was uh, an example of me and my ex-girlfriend she had well I think it was like we were three years into the relationship she was Taiwanese and she was we were like uh no i'm sorry we're a year and a half into a relationship and we got to talking and i asked her well what things do you not like about me are is there anything i mean please be honest and tell me straight that if there are things that are that you tell me what exactly you do not like about me what characteristics characteristics or traits you don't like about me and she came out and said it. Um, I had to coax that out of her and she said, well, the truth? And I said, yeah. And she said, well, you're full of shit. You're two-faced, you're a hypocrite, you're a liar. You say one thing and you do another. And I was shocked. Pretty much, I said, really, are you sure? I mean, she said, yeah, that's how strongly I feel about it. And. I said, well, that's pretty strong language. And she said, yeah, I know, but it's true. And that's one thing I really do, uh, that's something that I really don't like about you. And I said, well, can you, I mean, how often do I do that? Can you give me like a percentage? 
She says, yeah, about 80%. 80% of the time you say something and you're not going to do it. So I know every time you open your mouth, bullshit. I go, really? Oh, whoa, okay, okay. Got my attention there. Um, you know, can you tell me the next time I do something that is unfavorable, would you just, or something like that? Can you, can you mention it or at least tell me? And, oh, and she said, yeah, okay. Now, you gotta remember, this is a girl that has, that has um, very good communication skills. She, her, her, and she's telling me her English is really good. You know, you, you would never have thought that she, she wasn't capable of communicating. See if everybody went through there. <laughs> Vodra got stuck over there. <laughs> See, did he get stuck? There he is. Okay, so she basically communicated and said that, um, that uh, let, me, let me go back. She, she's a really great communicator and what bothered me a lot about that was, you know, that was really like really strong language and I, I just didn't believe it. I had a hard time believing it. So. Where are we? Oh yeah, we're at the University of Hawaii and we're gonna go through where we're not supposed to go. <laughs> yeah, this is um, Campus Mall. It's really beautiful. Really something, isn't it? So this is the last day before um, uh, summer session starts on Monday. And they just got done with finals, so this is the perfect day to ride through, except on the weekend. Besides weekends. We're gonna take a picture of this one. And there's the east-west garden. I'm gonna take a picture here. 